What's up YouTube? Welcome back to another video and today I'm going to be showing you guys all the necessary tools for beginning barbers and if you guys haven't yet subscribed to the channel please hit that subscribe button and let's get into the video. Alright so I'm just going to be showing you all the necessary tools basically the basic tools you need to start cutting hair. Alright so first of all you need a clipper and a trimmer and uh, I recommend the wall magic clips and the slimline pro ally. I believe these two are very good clipper and trimmer and they're probably the best combination and you also need some sort of shaver and you can get the wall shaver or the Andy shaver now with your clippers you need a um, clipper guards just some sort of guards that fit your clipper and I have the wall guards any kind of guards make sure you have like the the half guard too sometimes the clipper guards don't come with the half guard or the one and a half, but make sure you have those two guards. If not, you can just get them off Amazon or something. But yeah, you need some clipper guards. And for combs, you only really need two combs, which is a flat top comb. I have a Andy's flat top comb and a hair cutting comb, like uh, to cut the top hair. And I just have a normal cutting comb. And these are the only two combs you really need. All right, so you also need some hair cutting shears. Just pretty much any hair cutting shears. I like my shears a little smaller just because it's easier to control when I'm cutting the top. And you also need some thinning shears. Also, just whatever you feel comfortable with, what kind of shears you like. And thinning shears are helpful when you're using shear over comb. Easier to fade and just remove bulk. And you just need some hair cutting shears and some thinning shears. Now for brushes, I only use two brushes. My clipper brush, which I use to, to wipe down the clippers. I don't use this on clients because I use this on my clippers. But for my clients, I use like a, just a normal brush. And I use it when I'm cutting hair, when I'm fading. I just brush off the hairs. Yeah, so you just need two brushes. Make sure you have a clipper brush and then a client brush so you can um, brush off the hairs and you need like like a duster like you can use the neck duster or you can you can just use a towel but you just need either one to dust off the hairs and you also need a straight razor I just have this steel Parker razor and it works pretty good and with that you need some some razors I just have these these shark ra razor blades they come in like single ones and you just put them in, in there and it's ready to go. And with that, you just need some shaving gel. It just, it's just very helpful. Um, the client doesn't really feel it when you're going through with the razor. They don't feel like the, the razor as much since the razor is just gliding over the gel. The Nick Safe is also very, uh, very helpful for beginners. Like when you're barely starting out to use the straight razor, it's just, um, it's just in case you nick someone when you cut someone on accident, you use this and it stops the bleeding. It's very helpful. And next we have the cape and the Sanex strips. Uh, just pretty much any cape. And you, you need Sanex strips just to separate the skin from the cape. Um, and yeah, it's just like a sanitary reason. You don't really want the cape touching every client, you know, just to stay clean. And you pretty much just need any cape. I, got, I get my capes off Amazon, so. So yeah, so you need some clips, uh, some hair clips, uh, just to s separate the hair from where you're cutting or something. And you just pretty much need any kind of clips. I got the duck clips. You need a spray bottle, just pretty much any kind of spray bottle. All right, so now moving on to the sanitary part. Uh, you just need some cool care just to disinfect your clippers. And some, some sort of rubbing alcohol or aftershave just to disinfect around after every haircut and and yeah you also need some barbicide just to disinfect your your tools like your clips your combs your guards and you can get like the the barbicide container so that's basically it that's basically all the basic tools you need to start cutting hair and it's not too much uh it's not too expensive i'll give a rough estimate of the total price right here and if you guys enjoyed the video, please give it a like. If you're new to the channel, please subscribe to the channel. Comment down below what kind of videos you guys want to see next. And 
Peace out, YouTube. Peace out.